Welcome, Bailey families. Just want to introduce you to Team Revere. This will be your child's uh, Bailey Middle School seventh grade team this year. Um, so I want to take this opportunity to introduce you to the teachers, some of the important information, Zoom codes and things that you will need uh, this upcoming school year. Uh, just take a moment to just quickly go through. This is Miss Kelly. She will be your child's uh, math teacher. We have Miss Ladaney for language arts. We have Ms. Isaacs for science, Mr. McLean for social studies, and Mr. Kennedy, who will be student teaching with Mr. McLean for the uh, first couple of weeks in quarter number one. We also have Ms. Hodge and Ms. Martin, who will be um, potentially some of your children's uh, homeroom and thunder time teachers. Um, so I just want to mention their names to you as well if your child has them for thunder time. This is Ms. Bright. Uh, the seventh grade administrator she was in the sixth grade last year so she moves up with your kids so hopefully you are familiar and your uh your child remembers her from last year Ms. Dreso will be the seventh grade counselor this year um also if you have uh questions about things that are happening at bailey outside of the school um, classroom setting Ms. bright and mr Dreso can help so they will be um, good contact points for you um, if you've got outside the classroom questions that need answers uh, here's our schedule. So we're trying to simulate a uh, normal schedule like if we were in school. So you can see our day starts at nine uh, with Thunder Time. So there will be a uh, Zoom code from your Thunder Time teacher that will also be typically your Red Block teacher. We'll, we'll get on in the morning, make sure everybody's ready for the day, um, get some uh, warm up day activities going. And then you can see how the schedule will break down from there with each class, uh, each core class being an hour long time for lunch and physical activity break, and then electives uh, at 1.45 that will be on an 8 day, B-day rotation um, for your child as well. So make sure that you know the schedule, your child knows the schedule, so they know where to be and what Zoom teacher to be with at that time. A um, couple of platforms, again, uh, just like last year, uh, all of our lessons and all of our content will be through Canvas. Um, most of the teachers will be doing Zoom or Google Meet for all that information. Um, they will go over with your child on the first day. And then we have other platforms like IXL that will be used uh, by the individual teachers on a needed basis for um, educational activities and materials. So student expectations, we just um, ask that you take a moment to look over these yourself. Have your um, child look over these so they know the expectations once school starts on Monday. Um, Attendance is required every class, every day. Um, so please make sure that the student is on time, has the Zoom code. Um, and if you are not, if your child is not going to be present part of the day, all the day, they still need to um, report that to the front office staff, just like an absence um, for a regular school day. So take a look at those. Um, if you have questions, again, Email the teachers, email Ms. Bright, and Mr. Dreso. We're here to help in any way we can. Um, so part two of the student expectations, um, did a, did a, digital citizenship, excuse me, and honor code are important this year because um, the learning will be starting out at home. So please go over expectations and um, good citizenship on the computer with your child um, before school starts on Monday. Uh, Contact information here is all of the core teachers contact information, their email addresses, their Zoom information. The Zoom codes will be the same um, all year as long as we do virtual. Everybody's code and password will be the same. So you don't have to worry about anything changing um, part of the way through. So just make sure that you are familiar with those. You have those um, so everything will go smoothly from day to day. Basic supplies. Obviously, we are asking that you have a CMS Chromebook for compatibility testing reasons. And then for most classes, paper, one subject spiral notebook where they can keep track of notes and other things um, that they do with their teacher each day. If you have any questions, again, please don't hesitate to reach out. We're here to help any way we can and make this as smooth as possible. We look forward to a great year.